Hello friends, this is last part of developing of to-do list application in PHP using Ajax, and in this part we will discuss how to remove to-do list from web page. In previous part, we have seen, how to check to-do list by using PHP with Ajax. Now we have process for delete of to-do list, for this we have go to index page, and here we have moved to write jQuery code. Here we have write, dollar document selector with on method, and under this we have right click event, with badge class, so when we have click on cross sign this block of code will execute. Under this, we have write task list ID variable is equal to dollar this with data method, and under this we have write ID, it will fetch ID attribute value, and store into task list ID variable. Now we have start write Ajax request, so here in first option we have write URL option set to delete task.php, it will send request to this file. In second option, we have write method and here we have use post method, for send data to server. In third option, we have write data and in this option we can define which data we want send to server, so here we have defined task list ID variable. Lastly, we have write success callback function. This function has been called if request completed successfully, and it will receive data from server. Under this function, we have write dollar with anchor tag id list group item with task list id variable with fade out method and under this we have write slow this code will remove whole row of badge on which we have clicked now we have moved to delete task.php file and here first we want to make database connection so here we have write include statement with database connection .php file it will make database connection after making database connection we have write if statement and under condition we have write dollar post task list id variable if this condition true, then it will execute if block of code. Under this block, we have write dollar data variable is equal to array. In array first key, we have write double colon task list ID with value like dollar post task list ID variable. Here we have store data in array format in local variable now we have write dollar query variable is equal to delete from task list table where task list id is equal to double colon task list id below this delete query we have write dollar statement variable is equal to dollar connect variable with prepare statement and under this we have write dollar query variable. This method will make delete query for execution. Now we have write if statement, and under condition, we have write dollar statement variable with execute method. Under this method we have write dollar data variable. If delete query successfully execute, then it will execute if block of code. Under this block, we have write echo statement with done, it will send response to Ajax request, 
so here our code is ready, now we have check output in browser. Friends, first we have refresh web page, after refresh of web page, here we want to check remove or delete of to do list from web page. For this we have click on cross sign, after click on this row cross sign, that row has been removed from web page. Now we want to check, that content has been also delete from MYSQL table also. So we have refresh page, so here we can not see deleted to do list on web page, that means it has been also removed from database also, so here we have make single page to do list application in PHP using Ajax. In this to do list application, user can add their to do list content, after this user can check their to do list, and they can also remove or delete to do list from web page and database also using PHP script with Ajax jQuery. If you have any query or input regarding this video tutorial, please comment your query or input in comment box, or if you like this video tutorial please share with your friends, or even you can also share on social media also. If you want to get more update regarding our video tutorial, Please subscribe our YouTube channel for get more update regarding release of future video. Lastly keep watching our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching this video tutorial.